Hi, good morning. I just woke up and welcome to my fitness instructional vlog. And today is another day to be healthy and productive. And the first thing I do when I woke up in the morning is to fix my bed. And today we will work out our chest, abs, and legs. One workout for our chest, one for the abs, and one for the legs. We will do knee right push up, planking, and knee to squat. 30 seconds and 3 repetitions per exercise. And don't forget to rest every repetition. And now I am getting ready for our workout. Just enjoy and be productive and I hope you will learn something. But before working out, let's warm up first because it will help raise our body temperature and increase our blood flow to our muscles. So always make sure that you will do a warm up before you start to work out. So our first workout is for our chest, the knee leg push up. First, kneel on the floor. Second, extend your arms and put hands shoulder width apart on the floor in front of you. Third, tighten your abs while you bend arms, lowering your toes torso until chest grazes the floor. And fourth, push torso back up by straightening arms, slowly and steady. And lastly, rinse and repeat. Do this workout for 30 seconds with 3 repetitions and don't forget to rest for 10 seconds in between. This workout activates our muscle groups throughout our upper body, including our triceps, pecs, and shoulders. This workout increases core stability. Similar to regular push-ups, knee push-ups require you to keep your core activated throughout the full range of motions. It gives our chest, shoulders, and arms a quality workout at the same time strengthening the muscles of the core. Just enjoy and don't forget to keep breathing. Okay, and don't forget the rest and this is the last 30 seconds for the knee leg push up. So our next exercise is for our abs which is planking. Do this for 30 seconds and 3 repetitions and don't forget to rest in between. Lay on the floor with your elbows under your shoulders. Hands flat on the floor and core engaged. Keeping your forearms and knees on the floor, slowly raise yourself upwards until your body is in a straight line from your knees to your head. Hold the position for 30 seconds and then for 3 repetitions and don't forget to take a 10 seconds rest in between. The benefits of the plank exercise is it strengthens our core, improves balance, posture, and flexibility. It also improves our metabolism and reduces belly fat. It also improves our mood and relieves our stress. So don't forget to rest in between and this will be our last 30 seconds for our ab workout which is the planking. Just keep going and keep breathing. So 
So our next exercise is for our legs, which is the kneel to squat. Do this exercise for 30 seconds with 3 repetitions and 10 seconds rest in between. So first, begin in a kneeling position with your knees hip width apart, with hands together resting in front of your chest. Second, inhale and brace your core. And third, exhale as you transfer your weight to your left foot and step your right foot backwards to return your right knee to the kneeling position. Kneeling squats are one of the best squat variations for toning your gluteus maximus. Focus your attention on the hip thrust range of motion to increase glute activation and hip extension. Additional lower body muscles work by kneeling squats include your quadriceps, hip flexors, adductor magnus, and hamstrings. So just keep going and don't forget to breathe. So don't forget to rest and this will be our last 30 seconds for our leg exercise which is the kneel to squat. So after we work out, don't forget to cool down, drink some water, and take some rest. That's all for today and I hope you enjoy and learn something. Stay healthy and stay motivated. Bye-bye!